Again, today, it's time to keep the home of the indie music. We just roll right radio. Negro te lo hace lo cura. Your girlfriend's Sunny Topic. El duro de lo duro. El fuerte lo fuerte. Que se acotó con tu tía. Te invita a que estés aquí en Vigil Pro Radio y veas el negro que te lo hace a lo oscuro. Con el gordito nido de la radio. The boys are in the back, pero hoy tenemos a... DJ Boom. Y seguimos aquí. Hoy, y mira, hoy el show de hoy está, el show de hoy está bueno. El show de hoy está bueno. Hablamos de um, los Boston Red Sox. Hablamos del bárbaro que se dio a la mujer y a la suegra. Hablamos de la mujer que tiene dos personajes. <risa> tiene dos personajes con su maquillaje. Eh, pero ahora vamos a hablar. Dejen el bullying, por favor. Ya, yeah, vamos a dejar el bullying. Dejen el bullying. You know, so, you know one thing, yo, I hate the fact that bullying doesn't have a, 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 like a direct translation to Spanish. It That's it. true. It doesn't. And it, actually, it bothers me. Me ma creo una palabra ahora. It bothers me. It bothers me. The fact that it bullying. doesn't. Bullying. Bullying. <laughs> bullying. Te la vas haciendo bullying. Te la vas haciendo bullying. <laughs> 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 bueno, seguimos aquí. So, vamos a hablar ahora. Eh... ¿Cómo le hablamos a nuestros hijos sobre la pornografía? Y vamos a comenzar con Jay, porque Jay, tú eres que tiene muchachos aquí. Lo mismo conmigo. No, porque Jay, porque dime. Sí, porque, que tú estás bien, eh, eh, tú tienes mucha experiencia. Eh, ¿sí? Exacto, porque lo que sucede es porque no hay, una, no, hay, no hay mejor voz que una voz de experiencia. Me está entendiendo. Te gustó ese fenómeno, ¿verdad? Una persona que tiene hijas. Eh, le habla, ¿A qué edad le hablarías tú sobre pornografía a las niñas tuyas? Para poder educarla un poquito mejor, vamos a decir, en mi opinión, y puede ser que yo esté mal, I'm open to listen to it, you know, comments on this. Yo estoy pensando ya 15, 16 años. 15, 16 años. Ahora, no, 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 pero aguanta, no, no me lo ataque así, uh, no me lo ataque así. Ya, yo quiero hacer una pregunta, y un poquito personal. ¿A qué hora comenzaste tú a darte manigueta? Honestamente hablando, para Japón. <risa> ya eh. Baja, Maica. ¿Cuándo eh, conociste a Manuela? A Manuela ya cuando tenía yo 12 Entrando a los 12, casi 13 años Ok, ahora eh, ac Nos acabas de interrumpir el show Pero no interrumpiendo porque ahora se metió el show Ojalá que el micrófono tuyo sirva eh, ah. Tenemos a Carlos ¿Te estás, estás hablando, Carlos? ¿Te oyes bien? Sí, oh. Ahora, pero, Carlos, sí, oh, te tengo una pregunta ¿A qué edad le vas a hablar tú a tus You have a girl, right? ¿A qué edad le va a hablar tú a tu hija sobre pornografía? Uf, cuando veo a Beyoncé, no sé, ¿qué edad es? Antes de los 15 años. Antes de los 15 años, ¿estás hablando de 11 o 12? 10. 10. Boom, ¿tienes un comentario tú? No tengo hijos, pero estoy around the same. Nowadays, yeah, you, because true. you know what it is? You first have to. Tú tienes que enseñarle lo que es sex first. Pero tú le vas a enseñar a un, a un niño de 10 años qué es lo que es sex. No, pero la I, cosa would es, go, I would go like 12, 13. Te, te voy a hablar claro. La cosa es: el punto mío es, es porque la. Eh, eh, el, eh, ¿Cómo te digo? Eh, hoy en día lo de la música eh, eh, lleva, habla, mucho de lleva, habla mucho entonces el YouTube está bien popular entonces de eso se está viendo de todo todos estos videos con todo sí. esto y la de la escuela con los niños eso está demasiado ahora but in order for you to explain what porn is you have to tell them what sex is first yeah, then I explain wanna, that yeah, I, wanna, I, wanna, I, I want to talk about porn first I will talk about sex okay. first so obviously You know, so, eh, en, en este artículo hablamos que, que deberían de hablar temprano y la edad que dicen, dicen de los 11 a los 13 años para las hembras, pero dice que para los hombres de 10 a 12, son una vez más, creo que muchas de estas eh, estadísticas eh, son eh, machistas, de cierta yeah. forma. Porque, ¿Por qué tiene que el hombre se a los 10 y la chamaquita tiene que ser yo, yo, Creo yo que tiene que ser al revés. Déjame hablar, déjame hablar creo primero. Déjame hablar primero, que yo no hablo hoy. Oh, habla. Más huevos. Yo creo que uno debería. Ahí va este ya, trata de ser camarón con su manita. Ahora sí, su pata de perro. Ok. Yo creo que la razón que ellos dicen que debe decirse a los hombres primero, a los varones primero, es porque la hormona de los varones encienden primero. Desarrolla. Like, we, we, we need that. Nosotros comenzamos a. Mierda, ese culo está grande. Uh, que la teta, uh, que esa mujer está linda. Las mujeres, no, que yo sepa, yo estoy diciendo por, por la experiencia que tuve yo con el chamaquito, ¿tú me entiendes? Y la, y la, eh. 
So, tú eras tú eras, tú eras, tú eras activo, tú eras que caminaba en la clase con el go para y te ponía el libro. No, 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 no,
Ahora, Jay, no, Jay. El, el padre, tú sabes cómo es cuando se está Ahora, 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 pero yo darte un punto de que de la bañera. Yo no sé una cosa yo. Yo he oído cosas en Santo Domingo. Eh, Carlos, aquí hay una regla que es cero celulares. Que es un show que se respeta. Uh, uh, Tú no vas a entrar a mi show a querer respetar a Jay, a querer respetar a Tripin, a Boom, a The Boy Sagar y el negro que te lo va a hacer oscuro. Aquí no aceptamos eso. <risa> ok, pero como te iba diciendo. ¿Tú me entiendes? Y yo he hecho, he escuché una historia de un caballero eh, llamado eh, Wilson Zorrilla. Eh, wow, con nombre de todo. <ríe> He's never gonna listen to this, so sorry. Eh, que se hacía una paja con, eh, eh, entre los cojines del, del mueble. Y conozco a otro que agarraba, tú ves la, la mata de plátano. A la mata de plátano le hacía un hoyito. ¿De y qué le, parte de ese de que son ustedes? Yo no lo entiendo. Este de y, le daban, y le daban duro a la mata de plátano. En Guaray no se hace eso. Son un par de campesinos. Hay diferentes maneras. Yo no creo que sea. Son familia de Egal. Como uno como yo que yo estoy viendo. ¿Habéis visto de Jay Cortez? Sí. Ok. En eso, el chamaquito, hay yo uno que es activamente loco con el sexo. Que él dice que la pelo de él, con la pelo for him sleep. Él le hace un hoyo, oh, se lo mete y cae preñada de que el pelo. Oye, el otro. Yo te tengo, ahora tengo una historia. Yo, yo, yo le enseñé. Ya no van a believe me. Ya no van a believe me. Ya no van a believe me. So I had a friend um, who um, we used to share a room. I'm not going to say his name because you might watch this. Um, but um, his way of jerking off was to pound the shit out of his bed. And I'm talking to you like. Like he was fucking. Yeah, like, like, like he was fucking his bed. Like. And, y él se venía arriba de su cama, arriba de su, arriba de su vaina y se contaba el mismo. I think it's nasty. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but listen, uh, but you know what? I, you know, I, 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 I like the fact that he told me because he was clear. Like, yo, listen, don't sit on my bed. Don't sit on my bed, yo. Don't sit on my bed. Y él decía, no, usted se hace su pago con su mami. Yo lo doy durísimo a mi cama. And listen, and... Man, that's like making a hole on your bed, man. Hey, listen, bro. Nah, you you know, really but, you, but you know what it is. Um, some, some girls do that too, though. Some girls ride their pillow. Well, that's different. Well. Because if you pound a bed, okay, but I'm pretty sure you can break your dick. <laughs> what? I don't know, bro. I, I'm I pretty didn't sure try you can break your dick. <laughs> I'm going to try. I'm not interested in trying it either. With a woman, I'm, I'm, but, but I think it should be different. But, but even, if, even, if you're, even if you're pounding the pillow, like, do you know what I'm trying to say? How hard is a pillow? You know what I mean? I mean, there, there's different pillows, too. Like, yeah, if oh, you fuck one of my pillows, no. you're breaking your shit in the uh, first stroke. What's it called? A tempurpedic? A tempurpedic? Yeah, yeah. You're breaking your shit in the first stroke. Prah. <laughs> so, it, it also says, um, not to get personal. Not to get personal with your stories. So, how do you, how, I don't know, I, I just feel like, how do you tell your kid, like, not being personal? Yeah. Que, what, que el ver, el ver porno y esa cosa es una forma de educación. No. Well, that's totally wrong. Because, just lying because about something else. So then the next point ends, it says, um, emphasizes that porn is entertainment, not reality. And I feel like that should have been told to me at a very young age. I'm serious, yo. Porque yo vi a estos negros con estos sables. Con estos super saiyan. Con estos super saiyan jeans. Entonces, yo pensaba... Esto cabe a mejar. No, I'm, I'm serious, yo. Oh. No, hold up. Yo pensaba, yo, coño, ¿por qué diablo yo tengo un seis y medio en un buen día, un siete en un buen día, y este mamá que tiene un doce y un quince? Un catorce, un trece. ¿Tú me entiendes? So, entonces, yo me siento incómodo como persona porque digo, coño, este tigre tiene un brazo mío. Pero está bien. My no forearm, nigga. Son estos, cuando tú veías los videos que duraban una hora y pico, Oh, ¿Y qué es? ¿Y qué es? ¿Por qué yo no llego a ese punto? No, que entonces que después la amiguito tío te dice No, que tú tienes que pensar en tu abuela Para que se te vaya de la puta Like, 30 minutes, 45 minutes Some people are going out Actually, you know, you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? You know that the average sex um, is actually like 
10, 15 minutes. Yeah, no, no, I'm That's saying, wild. but there's people that could go 30 minutes, 45 minutes. Pero, 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 pero no todos los días, no todos los días. Estamos hablando que, oye, en lo vi, cada video que un lugar... No, no, una hora y media. Una hora y media. Mano, y tú, ¿qué coño? Pero ¿qué diablo es? Pero es en antes, ya, por Honda ya no hace eso. Ya, por Honda, ya no hace eso. Por Honda, a lo mejor es 12 minutos. A lo mejor es 15 minutos. Por Honda, a lo mejor es 15 minutos. Por Honda, a lo mejor es 15 minutos. Por Honda, a lo mejor es no tenemos mujeres, tenemos que hacer. No, yo y yo, yo Pojan somos amigos, tú no sabías. Yo me mandé un membership exclusive. No, 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 yo tenía un membership era con um, Bang Bros. Oh. Con Bang, Bang Bros. Bros. Diablo, oye. That's no, no, te voy a decir una cosa, te voy a decir una cosa. Había una cuenta de Bang Bros que nosotros teníamos. Que esa cuenta, tra oye, esa cuenta fue de Coast a Coast. La gente allí en Cali llamaban, oye, cambiar la, cambiar la clave. <laughs> Cambiar la clave, no puedo bajar video. Ahora, la segunda. Um, we keep it going. Um, breaks down the ways that porn differs from real life sex. How do you tell... How do you tell a kid, listen, the 12-inch dick that you've seen on Pornhub is not real? I would have been like, look at your dick. Look at that nigga. That's not real, nigga. Relax. Calm down. Oh, daddy, but what if I grow up into it? You're not gonna grow up into it. <laughs> so, but uh, how do you, how, Carlos? Thank you for um, joining us one more time. Um, how do you, how do you, how do you break down um, the ways that porn hum differs from real life sex? Uh, you realize it? Yeah. There you go. Let's like that. You let him learn. But you got to do the After you introduce him to that life and that pleasure. Yo, if I let him live for a little bit. No, pero no, si yo tengo, una, yo tengo esa oportunidad de, de, espérate, ven acá, yo te enseño cómo. Es. <laughs> You know, y, y, y así como, you know, whatever. So, tú vas a agarrar una potituta y vas a poner al muchacho tuyo al lado para que te vea. Oh, una de las putas mías. <laughs> <laughs> that is sick. Oh, no, that is sick. Actually, yo, you know, that's a lot. ¿Por qué no, mi hermano? Si, 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 yo no tengo, yo no estoy, yo no estoy con la, la, la mamá de mi, de mi hijo. Y, you know, I'm a single the father. And you got a party ready to go. I got to show him, like, you know, this is how it's done. You know, you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy about this? So, hubo un tiempo, eh, cuando yo estaba en San Domingo, fui a un cabaret uh -huh. con... La pasión. No, no fue una pasión, mm -hmm. fue un cabaret de allá no, de, no, de, de Alto Mayor. Eh, y yo, en un momento, me ofrecieron la cosa, si tú quieres un cuero, déjame saber que yo te lo ordeno. Right. Yo dije que no, porque obviamente yo un chamaquito inocente. De, I was probably like eighth grade. Maybe a freshman in high school, I think, because I might have gotten that summer for that. Um... Pero yo me pregunto, had I said yes at that moment, what would have my experience been after? You know what I mean? Because I feel like that's what you're saying. Like, listen, así que se hace. ¿Tú me estás entendiendo? Vamos, vamos, let's add up to what he's saying. Yo tengo un amigo en domingo que el papá pensaba que iba a salir medio maricón porque he got raised around six females. El chamaquito, oh, mami, enséñame a fregar. Mami, enséñame a hacer esto. Mami, enséñame a, a, a coser. Su so, papá, medio curioso, a los 14 años le dijo, ve acá, vamos allí. Se lo llevó a la cabaña Bernal, allí en Mao, y le dijo, mira, es una mujer, méteselo. De aquí tú no sales hasta que yo no vea que esa tipa tenga leche encima de ella. Papá se lo para afuera, pasó una hora, el chamaquito asustado, no sé lo que hacer. Pasó dos horas. Ya la tipa dijo, mira, va a volver. yo te voy a enseñar. El chamaquito hizo lo que tenía que hacer, de ahí para adelante. El chamaquito en, en Mao, considerado un duro. No, pero tú sabes ahora que eso, no, perdón, que es otra cosa, que ahora antes son los hombres, después que tú te das 15, 20, 30 mujeres, tú eres un duro, tú eres un fuerte. Tú eres un sucio. Eso no es lo que te hace un duro. Yeah, está. Lo que te hace un duro es como el negro. Dile, Carlos. Oh, yo, eh, eh, eh. Silence. The show's over. <laughs> <laughs> no, una bomba, no, la bomba, no. What you want? Quick, quick, quick. No, but, it, but for real, to be honest, if you have that opportunity, then, you know, why not? I, I didn't even get a sex talk. Maybe. I mean, I, I didn't really, get a, yeah. I didn't get a, like, all like I was like, ponte el gorito, ponte el gorito. That's all. Like, they already knew I knew what a condom was. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I never got like, oh, listen, you got, you know, like, obviously health class and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? You like, you obviously learn and everything. But, and, but you know, like, if you have the opportunity to, you know, to teach your, your son, you know, how to have, how to do it and everything and be prepared or, You know, etc. Obviously, he's still going to be nervous and etc. for his first time. You're not taking anything from it, but obviously, you'll you'll he'll be full, feel more comfortable when he when that happens. True. You know, but to each his own. Every, everybody has their way of, of thinking and etc. But I think if you have that bond with your son, why not? I, I'm gonna have to agree with you on that one, Carlos. 
Yo, Jay, pero yo te dije, Jay, que tú tienes que tirar para el tercer muchacho. How old are you? He's older than me. 27. 28. Why are you crying? I'm 33. I got a daughter, brother. Exactly. Yeah, man. Are you aiming for more kids? I would have had twins right now. Okay. You're about to have twins? No, I would have had twins. Okay, I got two already. I don't think I want them. Honestly, we have two girls? Two girls. Yo, Jay, listen to me. You know, actually, you know what's funny? Don't do that. You don't do that. You know, I I just spoke to uh, and you know, going off the topic, I just spoke to this um this guy. Whatever his name is, Reg, Reggie, Reggie, something like that. Um, I was at a wedding this um this past Thursday, and um you know we were talking about you know marriage and how you know you come up with people and blah blah blah. blah and in the conversation, the kids came up, and um and he asked he and you know he has two girls and shit. He said, yeah, I wanted a boy. And I was like, oh, you should go for the third. Like you know what I mean? You should go for the third. He's like, he listen. He's like, you know how much a Range Rover costs, All right? And I'm like. I'm not getting it. Like, what the fuck? What do you mean? How much a rainbow yeah, cost? Exactly. He's like, listen. Somebody's cost a rainbow. He's like, look, listen. Right now, I'm over. My, he's like, right now, I'm over my budget with two Range Rovers. So I'm like, oh, so sell them. He's like, I can't sell my two girls. <laughs> <laughs> I can't sell my two and, girls. Is it tougher? Wait, wait. I'm a, from my father's side. I'm the only child. Well, not till now, till recently. Uh, and for for me, it was just cool. Is it hard for girls, right? Since you have girls, it, it's 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 crazy. It's harder. Be, look, look. I'm gonna be honest with you. It's harder. When they get older, cause you, you, you gonna be the, you gonna be their bitch. Right. You know what's crazy? Um, this guy was talking to me about you know about raising about raising girls and um, cause he was kind of in the situation where I was you know I was I was raised with three uh, three boys, um, and um, he talks that like being a father of two girls taught him much more about women than all the experience that he had with women, because yeah, like women are child. How old is your daughter, if you know what I'm asking? Six. Six. So is mine. La mía los otros días me dice, oh, I want to, she tells her mom, I want a phone, but doesn't give her a brand. She comes to me, and she goes, oh, daddy, I want an iPhone X. ¿Por qué? Porque ya tienen su forma de buscarle lado al papá. Entonces, I'm like, you're not getting an iPhone X, I'm going to get you a tablet. And I was telling the story earlier, I'm like, yo, reason why is, if once I decide to move to Florida, and they're not with me, at least I can have that communication, we can FaceTime. Until I can get all the arrangements done to have my kids with me. True. So, I was like, a phone? That'll be a bad mistake. Because if right now she doesn't have a phone, she grabs my mom's phone and she calls me. Oh, order me food. Calls me. Oh, um, you're going to help me with my homework. Oh, do this. So it's like, okay, I see already that she's starting to get the hang of the phone. And you're saying it, so it's like, okay, I'm giving in to her. Because I'm not going to go out and, and again, it's she bad by me. Uh, and I know six years old, how yes. crazy is that? First grade. First grade, yeah, definitely. So, no, that's what I'm saying. And I know that and this is going to sound six. very crazy. And the white need to be get... I wouldn't get her an iPhone X, but and if I get myself a new phone, I'll just hear. Oh, yeah. No, no, I think, well, let me say this, yo. So, now let's bring that in. Let's bring that in. Let's bring that in. <laughs> Why would you say just the white neighborhood they, they would do that? No, not drugs. Somebody, right? somebody with money. Mostly in the white, white neighborhood, most of the kids will do have do have on um, phones. First grade. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but okay. So now, when but you those are kids that be like we have contact, we are tracking, we have any everything. No, 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 I, no. They're just no, no, no. no, no, no Ninety-five percent no, no. of the time, those are the kids that turn out to be the ones that they you treat understand. their parents like shit. Why? No, because they, they get everything they want. And no. when you don't give it to that's them, not, they rebel. No, 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 that's not. That's not always true. true. No, no. I mean, I mean they eat up. Okay, let's say there, there's times that parents do it just because um they no, they no, want to know where they at. They want to track them and, and shit. Like, you know, like, <laughs> <laughs> like they like they parents want to track their kids sometimes, and you sit give them an iPhone, you could know where their location is at. Very good. You know what I mean? So that's why that's why in white like white neighborhood of people with money take care of the kids because it's about. Kidnappings and all that suburbs, bullshit. Like, yeah, let's refer to this as the suburbs, not the white. No, I'm talking. That's why I said. You say more shit in this show. You say more shit in this show. That's racist right there. That's racist against us, motherfucker. Freedom of speech, bitch. Hey, listen. Yo, listen, yo. It's already ten to fifty-two. I think it's about that. Yeah, yeah. We gotta go do some, uh, some illegal stuff that's gonna happen behind closed doors. Um. Gang, 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 gang. Scoot it up! 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 Sc
Ugly ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, 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 uh.